This is breaking news from News 8. That breaking news this Wednesday, violence all over Rochester. At least seven victims shot overnight in the city at six scenes, all happening within about 90 minutes. Hayden Wentworth joins us live this morning from RPD headquarters with new details on each of these cases. Hayden, what can you tell us? Brennan, good morning to you. A hectic night for RPD. Police rushing to those scenes back to back, just coming off of the 4th of July. Here's what we know right now. Just before 11 o'clock last night, two people were shot in separate locations. On North Goodman Street, a 29-year-old man was shot. At the same time, a 30-year-old man arrived at the hospital in a private vehicle after being shot near Cottage Street and Jefferson Avenue. About an hour later, police responded to MLK Park for another person shot. Here they located another victim, a 19-year-old man. And just before 12.30, two more shootings with three people shot. The footage here is from Mina Drive and Robert Street, where two people, a 25-year-old woman and a 44-year-old man, were wounded. Around the same time, another victim arrived at the hospital after being shot near Sterling Street and the Sylvan Street. And at 12.30, an additional victim arrived at the hospital. The 23-year-old man was shot on Webster Avenue. Now, all of these victims are expected to survive. No arrests have been made, and police say, as far as right now, they don't know if at any point these shootings are connected. Reporting at the Public Safety Building, Hayden Wentworth, News 8. Brennan, back to you. Hayden, thank you. Just a busy, crazy night with the violence here in Rochester.